Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. If you are already subscribed, welcome back. My name is Sierra and in today's video we are stuffing my last paycheck from January. Crazy to think that January is already almost over, um, but I'm excited to do this video because I am going to be announcing the giveaway and um, just make sure you guys stay tuned for that. That way you can figure out what the giveaway is and enter if you would like to. Today we are stuffing $788, so I'm going to go ahead and set the money up and then we will get started. All right, so now that I have the money set up, we'll go ahead and start off with my cash envelopes. So I am gonna be stuffing my cash envelopes this week. You guys know I do them every week. I didn't do them last week, and I explained why in last week's cash stuffing, but we are back on track for this week. Um, this A7 binder I did get off Amazon. A lot of you guys ask. So all you have to do if you wanna get one is just go on Amazon, type in A7 binder, and you should see a bunch of different colors. Um, so we're going to go ahead and start off with myself and this week I am stuffing $20 for myself. Next is for babies and babies is going to get $20. Speaking of babies, so um, if you guys remember I told you all the money that I have left over from my envelopes at the end of the week, I do put in my kids' piggy banks. I did that last year with my change as well. Um, but this year, I'm going to be saving my change up for myself and cashing it in at the end of the year. I just want to see how much change I'm going to save. So um, I'm looking for a change jar. I saw a cute one on Etsy. It was like, I forgot what it said, but I think it was like somebody who makes um, like a well-known Etsy girl i just i can't remember exactly what it said but it's like a, a change jar and it has like pink lettering on it somebody is going to know what i'm talking about i just forget what was on it maybe i think it says coins i don't know but i'm going to do that right now i have my change just in my wallet um in the little coin pouch so i'm gonna get a change jar and we'll add it up every week and you know go from there so next is for dine out dine out is going to get forty dollars Normally, I do my cash stuffings on Fridays. As you guys know, I normally upload on Fridays. But yesterday, I didn't really do much. Um, didn't spend any money or anything. So it's not really affecting me that I'm uploading today on Saturday. Um, only thing I did yesterday was I did go to the car wash. But I have my monthly membership. So I don't have to pay anything, you know, outright. So we're doing fine. I didn't spend anything yesterday. So um, next is for groceries, and groceries is going to get its normal 60, so 50, and then a 10. Moving along to Starbucks. So Starbucks this week is going to get $18, so a 10, a 5, and then these three ones. And I'm budgeting this out because my kids have been asking to go to Starbucks. They love the cake pops. Um, I don't like to get them for them that often, but I figured, you know, since I'm off today, I'll budget out for that and we can go get cake pops and I'll get my coffee. Um, they really enjoy just going and sitting at Starbucks, so I don't mind it. And I have limited myself to one Starbucks a week, so that's what that money's for. Um, nails, I'm not stuffing anything right now. I just, I just got my nails done a couple days ago, so I don't really need to stuff this week. Um, next is for necessities, and necessities is going to get $30. Do need a few things, just like hair care products, and, um, I think we need, yeah, paper towels. Um, so, 30 bucks will do. And then last is for gas, and gas is getting 40 So... Like I told you guys already, I haven't been going anywhere, haven't been doing much, so I lowered my gas from 50 to 40, and it's been doing me just fine. So that's my cash envelopes. I do keep those in my purse. Um, somebody said, do a what's in my purse. Honestly, my purse has turned into like a toy box slash diaper bag for my kids. So yeah, not diaper bag, but like, you know, kid stuff. Um, so yeah, my purse isn't very exciting. Anyway, so that's it for the cash envelopes, and then we'll go ahead and move on to my binders. Um, I'm going to do, we'll do short term first this time. 
All right, and before we do get started, I just wanna mention something. So I got a comment on one of my videos and it actually bothered me because I just want people to understand something. So the comment was something along the lines of, aren't you supposed to be teaching people how to save money, not wasting your money on unnecessary things? Like all of this stuff in your videos is just a waste of money. Um, and you could do that with plain white envelopes. So to be completely honest with you guys, I normally don't care about comments like that or people commenting like annoying rude things, but I just wanna explain this to you guys because it is important. So number one, my videos that I post, this is all of my stuff that I enjoy. I enjoy these things, I enjoy the bling stuff, I enjoy you know buying new envelopes and all of that stuff. Not only that, but sometimes you have to spend money to make money and since I've, you know, established myself on YouTube, do you think that I would have gotten this far along if I just got on here with plain white envelopes and just had a boring background and no, you know, aesthetic to my channel and didn't personalize it to me? I really don't think I would, you know, have gotten this far along if that was the case. Third thing is I love supporting small businesses and me buying this stuff, all of this stuff is from small businesses, especially the envelopes and things. I'm helping somebody maybe reach a goal. You don't know what that person's goal is, you know, so me buying these envelopes is helping them out in some way and I enjoy that. That makes me happy at the end of the day. So not only do you have to, you know, spend money to make money sometimes, um, but I'm helping out small businesses and yes, you can do this stuff with plain white envelopes and stuff like that. But since I've, you know, built myself up to this level, I guess you can call it at this point, I have the extra money, you know, I get my YouTube checks and stuff. And sometimes you have to invest in yourself in order to make yourself make more money. But anyway, let's go ahead and um, start cash stuffing. So first envelope is for Christmas and Christmas this week is getting $10. All right, so Christmas now has 20, 30, 40, and 50. Told you guys I'm not going overboard this year for Christmas, so I'm just kind of stuffing whatever at this point. Next is for clothes, and clothes is going to get $10 as well. So clothes now has 10, 20, 30, and 40. Moving along to Amazon. So Amazon is going to get $20. Right, that gives it 20, 40, 50, and 60. Next is for YouTube giveaway, and giveaway is going to get $5. That gives it 10, 15, 20. 25 and next is for date night date night this week is going to get $15 10 20 30 5 and 40 And a last envelope is for birthdays, and birthdays is going to get 10. And that gives it 20. So that is it for my short-term binder, and then we'll go ahead and move on to my long-term binder. All right, first envelope is for Aston, and Aston is getting 50. You guys know I do normally $50 every week. Unless I have like extra money, then I'll add, you know, maybe a hundred sometimes. So Aston now has 50, one, 50, and two. Next is for Alea, and she is also getting $50 this week. All right, so Alea now has 50, one, 50, and two. Another comment that I wanted to mention that I saw someone um, leave on my um, video was that they were like wow I'm surprised you give your kids money from your taxes most people don't because the kids don't work for the money 
so they were like I'm surprised you give you know money from your taxes and I'm like well let's see number one I wouldn't be getting probably nearly as much tax money as I do if it wasn't for my kids um so even though I spend a lot of money on them throughout the year their future is important at the end of the day I'm looking at their future not just giving them money you know to go buy dumb stuff right now like I'm putting this money away for their future so if you're gonna say your kids don't work so they don't deserve any of your tax money like that just doesn't even make sense so you don't care about your kids future because they don't work they can't work their kids so yeah like I don't even understand how people would even come to that logic of thinking like that's even a normal thing to say anyway Next is for family time, and family time this week is going to get $20. Alright, so that's going to get $20, $40, $60, $80. Moving along to vacation, and vacation is going to get $30. Twenty and then a ten, and vacation now has twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, one, twenty, thirty, and forty. So one forty for vacation. Next is going to be for the house savings, and the house savings is going to get twenty dollars. All right, so this envelope now has twenty, forty, sixty, and eighty. All right, so next is for the business envelope, and for business, it is going to get 20 bucks. So it now has 20, 40, 60, and 80. Next is for the surprise envelope, and surprise is going to get 40. So it has 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, and 60. So 160 for surprise. Next is for new car, and new car is going to get $50. Right, that gives us 51, 50, and 2. And that is it for envelopes. Next, we're moving on to challenges. And this week, I am stuffing 150 um, out of this. So somebody was like, can you please cross off the little things? I tried crossing them off, and I don't know why, but my little Sharpies just wiped right off. So I'm going to have to find a bigger, um, like the thicker Sharpies to cross it off and hope it doesn't rub. But, I mean, I've only stuffed it four times, so I know the, you know, amounts that I've stuffed so far. So I'll figure that out. Um, so it gets a 100 and then a 50. All right, so 10,000 Savings Challenge now has 1, 2, 3, 4, 50, 5, 20, and 5. So 525 for that. Next is for the $20 challenge or the $1,000 challenge. Um, I told you guys already this. I don't have like a set time that I want to finish it. Um, just something that I'm doing so it now has 40 and last thing that we're stuffing today is the Disney savings challenge and that is getting 40 bucks so it now has 50 70 90 110 30 50 70 and 80 and we should be close to 1500 because if you guys remember I had like 1200 and something roll over from last year so we should be close to 1500 there um, but yeah that is pretty much it for my cash stuffing and now we will announce the giveaway so for the giveaway for 14,000 subscribers I am going to be giving away a cash stuffing starter kit so basically if you're the winner you'll get to pick out which binder you want which envelopes you want and then i'll stuff the envelopes with a certain amount of cash to kind of get you started on your journey so if you do want to be entered into the giveaway all you have to do is leave a envelope emoji down below in the comments 
along with your comment and that will enter you into the giveaway. You guys know I don't do all that extra stuff when it comes to giveaway. Just leave a comment down below and comment a envelope emoji in your comment somewhere and you will be entered into the giveaway. That way I know, you know, who's interested and who's not. I'm still gonna be doing the help a person in need um, with a little bit of my tax money once, you know, I do get that and yeah. That is the giveaway for $14,000. we are actually almost closer to $15,000 now. So I try to do giveaways every 1,000 subscribers. Um, so I'm sure I'll be doing another one. So stay tuned. Um, also, you do need to be subscribed to my channel if you do want to enter into the giveaway. And if you're not already subscribed, make sure you go ahead and subscribe. That way you don't miss any videos from me. And click that notification bell. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video, you guys. I'm going to go ahead and get dressed and take my little kids to Starbucks. And that's it. We'll see what else I get into for the day. But thank you so much for watching. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.